but pray. Pray for myself. I prayed for Kevin. And I prayed for his family to find peace. Earl Jones was tearful before learning his sentence today, but prosecutors doubted his sincerity just as the jury doubted his story in this murder. While he stands here crying or pretending to cry in front of you, I still do not hear the words, I'm sorry, come out of his mouth. A jury convicted Jones of murdering Kevin Neary. Neary was the new boyfriend of Jones's ex. Jones shot Neary in May of 2016 in front of a home in Coleraine Township. He claimed he was acting in self-defense. Neary's mother said no parent should have to bury their child. I'm not the same mother, wife, daughter that I once was. I'm lost, stuck in this deep, dark hole of grief, a hole that I have to live in for the rest of my life. I still can't believe that this is real, that I will never hug or touch Kevin again. Kevin Neary was 19 years old. His family says he was looking forward to going to college and becoming an engineer. I'm asking the courts to consider what was taken and what could never ever be given back. To keep in mind that Kevin never has a second chance at life. We are asking the courts to consider the maximum sentence by law. Earl Jones is 24 years old. He was sentenced to life without the possibility of parole, plus an additional three years for the gun specifications connected to this crime. From the Hamilton County Courthouse, Andrew Setters, WLWT News 5.